What is going on, you guys? It's your boy, Alex West Collects here, bringing you another figure review. Today, we are taking a look at the Fan Takeover Elite Seth Rollins action figure. Uh, these are now Amazon exclusives. They were originally scheduled to be Walmart exclusive. That seemed to change, um, and Mattel has now moved it over to their new home on Amazon. So if you are looking for this figure, that is the only place to grab them. Uh, I definitely love the colors on this box. The blue and yellow look great. Uh, very excited for this Seth Rollins. This is actually the one I voted for, so the fans got to choose the attire from the poll. On the back, you can see the different attires they had up for grabs. It was WrestleMania 35, Survivor Series 2019, which came in second, and SummerSlam 2018, which came in third. They seem to be very close, uh, both around the 30% range. Uh, you have the other figures in the wave. I do have Ricky the Dragon Steamboat coming. Did not want Adam Cole and don't really want Shayna Baszler. I already have Cole, so figured um, another Cole. Uh, didn't really want that one. You got the image of Seth on the other side. We're going to come back and get this figure out of the packaging. So here we have Seth Rollins out of the packaging. And um, my one gripe, I feel like his attire was definitely a brighter gold. This looks a little too dull. So I'm going to take some points off from there. And mine kind of came with a, a really loose foot peg. I'm going to see if I can take that off and maybe fix it. If not, I'm definitely going to see if I can get a replacement from Amazon, uh, which kind of sucks. But, I mean, again, I was at WrestleMania 35, so uh, definitely was a big fan of this attire when he came out. Uh, look at the accessories he comes with. You can see he comes with a bunch of interchangeable hands, which we've seen before. And this really is just a repainted Rollins. I feel like we've seen this head quite a few times on the last few elite releases another gripe so if you look on his hands on his wrist tape sorry um one of them has the rollins logo and the other doesn't i don't think that's accurate i think they were on both sides so that's another bummer on there i was really looking forward to this so quite a few kind of knocks but um take a look at the the vest you see the gold on the front continuing down his tights Got the Rollins logo on the knee pad, the gold trim on the kick pads, continues on the sides and on the back, uh, vest claps, clasp in the back, see he does have some design on there, remove it just like that, let's get this vest off and take a quick look, see how he looks underneath, okay, so here we go, he's got the nice chest hair, looks very good accurate to how Seth Rollins should look. Uh, articulation, obviously, you know, standard for most elites. I'm so happy we're finally getting double jointed elbows, but this one does have the double jointed knees. Um, this is this single joint, so just announced by Mattel, this will be a standard on elites going forward. Starting with Elite 85, hopefully by the end of the year, it'll be a full conversion. We will finally have double jointed elbows in the elite line, just like we do with the ultimate figures. Um, so, I mean, pretty basic Rollins. Like I said, we've seen this guy so many times before. So if you're a fan of this gear, definitely go grab it. Um, and if not, not a must have. And just to throw a few Rollins in there, here's another top pick, which is one of my favorites. And I think still to this day, this might be my favorite Seth. The Cash and Seth from the Toys R Us exclusive. So I hope you enjoyed this quick review. Um, as always, like, comment, share this video. Let me know what you think of this figure. Will you be grabbing it? Um, be sure to follow me on Instagram at Alex West Collects. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel for more great content. Thanks for checking this out and take care.